guys welcome back to raft survival today we're going to be getting into some of the nitty gritty we're going to research the rest of the items in the entire game and just kind of travel around and build some of the items that we haven't got yet as well mr sharko is going to town here i'm gonna poke him always gotta poke him gotta keep poking him uh so we have copper ingot now and we have enough copper ingot to craft a circuit board which is what we are going to do. Where would the circuit board be? Here's the circuit board. We need uh, one more vine goo, actually. Do we have some goo available to be vined? Right there. The goo is being vined. We might actually even have some in here somewhere. Yeah, we do. Okay, so let's take that. Let's take the copper, and then I'm going to craft a circuit board. We're going to throw our fish. Let's throw the tilapia on the fire real quick. Come on, Tilapi. Get on the fire. All right. And I'm going to drink a little bit of water. Get some planks on all these bad boys. All right. Fishy is a cooking. Where is our excess food supply? Here it is. Boop. And this is our excess everything else supply. There we go. Uh, we'll probably keep smelting this metal. We don't need to smelt more copper, I don't think. What up, Sharko? And boop. We'll just keep doing that to him as much as we can. All right, we got that extra goo. Now we can craft a circuit board. All we need is plastic. Boop, and circuit board crafted. And the circuit board thrown in here, and bam, 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 bam. We've learned everything in the entire game. I don't know what any of this stuff does, like the receiver and whatnot, but I guess we're about to find out, right? So the battery is crafted with this, used to power electrical machines. Huh. What do these electrical machines do for us, is the question. Receiver, used to locate nearby radio signals, so maybe it does like crashed rafts or something. And we also have this really cool anchor that we need to start working on. We haven't done nearly everything yet, but we're working on it. And I'd like for my raft to just, I really wanna just redo the whole thing. Like I really do. But, like, having all these pillars here just kind of uh, doesn't make me want to do it because pillars aren't cheap. But look how unevenly placed all these pillars are. I mean, we could start knocking some down, but then we're going to lose the stuff up top. What up, Sharko? Oh, you getting pissed. You getting pissed, boy! Ooh! We're good. All's good. All's good. We're fine. All's good. We're going to keep the metal smelting because metal is quite important. And, uh, copper. We'll smelt the copper, too. Throw the hinges in here. We also have a raw mackerel. One thing that I wanted to get going today was that better grill. Uh, for sure. Because that better grill is going to help us a lot. Again, storage is going to be downstairs. I think up here. I want to start building out, though, man. We just don't have the wood for it. Oh, we haven't even chopped any of the wood yet. We haven't even gone up to the top of the island. I forgot about that. Pineapple. Okay, wait. Let me drop off some stuff. I completely forgot. How did I forget that we haven't been to the top of the island yet? We have so much stuff to do today. Um, let's go ahead and throw... We got fishy fishies in there. We'll put a little bit of stone... Not stone. Metal thing in there. Put a little bit of you, a little bit of do, and a little bit of da. And let's go on up. Because we need to go on up. We need to get to the top of this island for whatever that secret thing up there is. I don't know what it's going to give us. Is he biting the bait again? He is. Oh, he finished the bait. Crap, I thought I'd be able to kill him through that bait, but I guess not. Alright, give me good planks. I need good, good amount of planks. Alright, that's a decent amount of planks. And we can get more out of this. Oh, dude, I'm just climbing. Woo! What is this, man? Look at it. That's so cool. Okay. Whoa, we got a lot of stuff out of that. More hinges, some vine goo, and look at this. It's just like some person's house they used to like live here or something you know that's cool all right gather some more planks and can we like gather your house no that kind of stinks i would love to get some more planks here like i said i really want to redesign this base a tad bit it feels a little disjointed right now but i don't think i can get up there but we can get over here at least to get more planks and more palm leaves and a little bit of everything Boop. And boop. Oh. No. No, no, Plank. No! We lost our one good friend, Plank. 
Um, palm seed, good vine. We'll just drop it off and we'll work our way back up because we need this watermelon as well. All right, where's our seeds? Here we are. Boop and boop and boop. And we'll throw our mango in there. We have an extra potato, actually. Mango goes here. Potato goes there. Hinge goes here. Vine goo goes here. These go there, but they're just going to stack anyway. All right, let's head back up. Oh, got another metal going. While we're out and about. What up, Sam? How you doing? Yuck! Good jump, dude. We're gonna have a lot of planks after this, actually. Do you think we should redesign the whole base? I'm feeling a whole base redesign right now. And I don't, I don't really know why. I just feel like it's not proper, you know? I guess we could just place down the pillars all proper. And then, uh... And then just kind of, like... Delete the ones that aren't proper, maybe? Maybe? Ooh. Get out of here, shark. What up, Sam? Get out of my face. Oh, Sam's dead. Of course our spear broke. Get out of here! He ate my shoe food. He ate my shoe food. Okay, but with that, oh god. With that, I do want to head underwater real quick, because Sam is dead. Hey! Let me... Uh, no! No, I can't be stuck! Get me off! Huh. Okay, we're good. Whew. Dive in! I want to go deeper. I gotta go deep. I can't see anything, but... More copper. More copper. Hopefully more sand. Like I said, I want to get another smelter going. That's metal. Oh, here it is. This is what we want. We need actual metal. Right, going up. Going uppity up, up, up. Even though I can't really see uppity up, up, up. Alright. That's good. Okay. Planks in there, get the metal smelting, and what we'll do real quick, just since we're here, we will place these in there, and we will grab ourselves... Is it here? Yeah. A few more wet bricks that we're going to place upstairs to dry out. And let me repair that real quick. And what we'll do is, I have more, yeah. We have more stuff in here. We also even have two dry bricks in there. Alright, so we craft another two dry bricks. I think that brings us up to five dry bricks, and we're actually getting pretty close to another smelter. And I would love to have these in, like, rooms. Like, put the smelter in a room. Unfortunately, I think if I remove this, it should pick it up. I'm really hoping, but I want to use all the planks in there first. Because if I pick it up and turn it around, like I said, I want to make a smelting room. We'll have a chest in here that actually literally has the things that you smelt with in here. I think it would just make a lot more sense, and then we'll have a room that, like, you cook food in and whatnot. I think that would just make, like I said, a heck of a lot more sense than how we have it set up right now. So, that's what we'll end up doing. I'll let all this stuff cook up. Sam's back. Hi, Sam. We're going back to the island, Sam, all right? We're just trying to chop down some trees, buddy. Just getting more and more planks for my uh, up-and-coming building processes. Anything over here? Nope. And then we're going to do this weird climb that I just did. I don't know how I did it, but I did it somehow last time. Yep, just like that. Now we can get a better idea of what this thing looks like. It's pretty cool. I'm just going to screenshot it because that's what I do. Um, another tree right here. What up, tree? Hola. Give me plank. I don't want mango or palm leaves. I want planks. Thank you. And I think if I go around the edge here, yep, we're going to find some watermelon that we can't pick up because I'm really bad at organization. And I'm actually just going to eat these real quick because they're getting low on food and water. Which that should hold us off for the time being. These are great for planks. We need to plant some palm trees, dude. I want to have like a roof where the palm trees grow. Um, you stupid mango seeds. We have too many of you. Get out of here. Alright, so that's everything I believe we can get unless there's a way that we can really climb the edge of this, but I don't think we can. I'll do this real quick. 
All right, we actually came out with 29 planks. We did use a few. Actually, we got another tree right here. We did already use a few to craft the axe again. We're going to need to craft another spear as well. Um, hmm. Can we climb this? No. Sam is totally going to pwn me right now, dude. Sam's not a fan. Hey, Sam! Nope, nope! My toes don't taste good! Huh. Oh, we're good. We're all good. We're all good. Alright, let's drop off. Let's drop off. Let's drop off. Alright, we got this. We got the metal here. We got this metal here. You need to smelt some more. Thank you. Copper there. Uh, we have plastic, which goes with the head. Boop. And we got a second head. I guess we can do a head trophy on the wall now. Um, copper. Do we have smelted copper in here already? We don't have smelted copper. I'm going to keep this on me and put that in there. And what else do we have? We have a cooked fish over there, I'm pretty sure. Better help us with our food real quick. Boom. Boom. Scada boom. And let's fill these up. Oh, it already is Phil. There we go. It already is Phil. English, my first language, thank you. And are the planks out of this yet? They're not. Okay, so now we need to start rearranging. Um, what I want to do is have like this be the main, you know, common area, right? If we remove this, I want to see if it's going to give it back to us. It is. Awesome. So with that giving back to us, I'm going to take this. Like I said, I want this to like be the main common area. So what I'll do is let's build a wall. The main common area I do want to have like built out. So like I want this to be nice and quiet in here. Uh, we'll have a ladder by the door. And we don't really need a door. Door's kind of a waste. But I want to give me your mackerel. I'm going to eat that. If we remove this, will it give us a plank back? I doubt it. It seemed to not actually do that for us. Let me throw something. Oh, it just picked it up. It's not letting me actually hold on to it? Oh, no. It is. Okay. Uh, we'll pick that up again. Again, we're going to lose two planks, but that's fine. And we'll pick up the shoe. All right. And now with that, we will build another wall. I know I removed some of these walls before, guys. I understand that. This one is backwards. I don't like that. We're going to have a little window right there. There we go, which just kind of looks out into the water. So with that, I want to remove this rug, and we're going to put that as our floor in our bedroom. So this is going to be our bedroom right here. I'm going to put that, like, corner it. All right, Sam, you win this time. You win this time, Sam. I'll replace that later. Um, and then with that, I want to do just a little bit of a, hmm, thatch wall on the interior. Let me grab some thatch real quick, actually. Thatch wall on the interior. Hmm, like that. That's nice. We're going to remove, oh, I'm going to drink that first. We're going to remove you. Boop. And then we are going to put you there, put you there, and then that's fine right there. It's like a little, it's like a little, a little nook there. It's really nice. I'm going to remove this though. This is just extra. We don't need this here. All right. So this is our little sleeping nook, which we will then put you in here like that in the corner. And I'm going to have my little bedside table, a little shoe. A little shoe bedtime, bedside table, which uh, I wish I could plant like a watermelon or something even funnier in there. That'd be great. We could put a table and stuff in here and we could put crop plots in here maybe. I mean, it's not really necessary. So this is going to be our cute little home right here. And then what I want to do is the storage is not going to continue to be a storage room. I'm going to use this as a light cooking and water purification room. Um, but we could put a big grill in there. I just don't know if we can cook small things on the big grill. I'm not sure yet. So maybe we should craft a big grill today. Um, let's go ahead and fill that up with fresh water. We're going to remove you. Oop, lost a few planks again. It's whatever. 
and the research table you have to move as well, which I don't even think we need anymore because I've already researched everything. So it's not a big deal. So what I'm going to do real quick, this might, uh, this might collapse the upstairs. Oh, it's totally going to collapse the upstairs, but here we go. Nope, nothing. Okay. I just wanted to put a window there. I want to put some windows in probably like, wait, so like this is on the corner and then this is going to be two. I want to fix this, but that's going to collapse. So we got to put a window first. Um, so like two and then a window, two and then a window, you know what I mean? So we're going to do this. Just gonna be nice. If you guys didn't know, I've always really enjoyed building in every single survival game that I've ever played. I've actually done mega builds and stuff in the past with like seven days to die and whatnot. Um, it's kind of my jazz. I like to have a nice, like flowing, functional base. Um, when I play alone, I have more so the chance to do that because, you know, I'm playing alone. I don't have to waste other people's materials. It's my grinding, you know? Um, so with that, that's really nice. That's getting, that's going nice. That's going nice. What we're gonna do these chests kind of get in the way right now. Um, I can kind of start moving them because I have this one here. Um, what we'll do is rotate slowly. Because this is going to be the smelting room. So we'll put that there. Metal ingot. And let me put another metal ingot in there while we're waiting. We also need to get this food cooking rather soon. But what I want to do is get rid of this chest if possible. I have an empty chest somewhere, I thought. I mean, whatever, it's seeds, right? This can go into the stupid flower seed thing. Actually, I can't. I don't have any of the red ones. Let's do this, this, and then we can remove it. And then I want to put the water purifiers and the other objects over here. I don't really care about the candle bottle. So, simple grill. Rotate you. Boop. And we'll do a little bit of this. So right along that wall right there. That's where all the goodies are. And what we'll do is we're going to put a little window right here. Because then we can peep to see when these things are done. Right there. From the outside. Which is nice and clean. And then what we'll do is just have a nice open door here that's going to lead into this room. And then we're going to block this off with thatch wall. But like right now we can't do that because like I said, these bins are not where I want them to be. I want to have like some bins maybe like back here in this corner. Maybe even one of the bigger bins because they do have the larger bins. But what do we need for those? It's a question. So you need a hinge. We actually have plenty of hinges. I just don't know how big these are going to be and if they're going to be worth it. I mean, we can give them a try. Might as well give them a try, because why not? Where's our hinges? We have our hinges here, and then we have our things here, and then we will... Let's craft one. Screw it. Let's see how it goes. So with that, how does it open again? It opens that way. That's nice. Sam, can you quit it? I don't have a spear. I don't have one. All right, I'm all out of planks. You're really starting to ruin my house here, too. Oh, God. We're running low on planks. That's not good. We should take off soon. What's in here? Give me these stupid fish and this dumb hook that's in there for some reason. And this dumb clam. You can, you can get out of here. I want to see what we can fit inside this. Hell yes. This is perfect for our cooking room. This is god tier for our cooking room. So we put our meat up there. We put our fish down there. We can put all our beets, our watermelon, our mangoes. So we'll put our beets, our beets, our mangoes, our watermelon. Our pineapple and then all the seeds as well that go along with it. Put our shark in there. Our coconut. We'll put our giant clam in there too. We got our pineapple. We got our coconut. We got our potatoes. We have more seeds, more seeds, more shark meat. And look at that. That's really helping us out. What I want to do is possibly put a large grill in here though. 
but we'll see if the large grill can cook smaller meat. If it can, then we'll replace it right there, and then we'll put a large water purifier here. So we're, we're slowly but surely getting our inventory situation settled out. So the house is coming along. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today's episode. Just a bit of a base building and island exploration episode. We do need to leave and get more planks to repair these corners, because if Sam decides to attack right here, he's going to hurt my entire base. So what? You can put these on walls? Okay. My life is complete. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today's episode. If you did, please leave a like on it. Subscribe if you're new here. Check the playlist link in the description down below. Be sure to turn on that notification icon, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Adios.